Have you ever... Have you... Ever had your computer crash on you? <laughs> have you had a virus that has taken over your presentation? Have you ever had to reboot in order to fix your computer? I've had this happen, and it's extremely embarrassing. It's also ridiculous. This is 2012, and this should not be how we expect computers to work. And that's why I'd like to tell you about a new operating system. It is called Xenactus. Using Xenactus, your computer will never crash again, and it will never be infected by viruses. Xenactus is safe. It is secure, accessible, fun, and easy for people of all ages. When your computer crashes, it's not your computer's fault. Despite what you may have been told, it's not your fault either. It's also not your grandma's fault or your three-year-old's or whoever else was playing around on it. It's one thing's fault, and that's your operating system. I bet you're thinking, well, I'm about to buy Windows 8. That's a brand new operating system. Certainly I'll be safe, right? No. Whatever operating system you're using right now is based off of old technology. Every version of Windows, the core of it, the core of the software, the kernel, the design, is based off of technology from over 30 years ago. I bet you're thinking, well, I don't have to worry about that. I use Mac OS. Or I don't have to worry about that because I use Linux. Or I only use an Android. I'm safe. It's never crashed on me. I've never had a virus. Well, guess what? That technology is even older. It's based off of Unix, and it hasn't changed at its core in over 40 years. This is ridiculous. Everything else gets better, and OSs don't. What is the difference? A little dark there. Can I have lights? Whatever operating system you're using right now is considered monolithic. This means that it is huge. And when you're using a monolithic system, the majority of the code in the kernel, in the base, is in privileged mode, where anything and everything can read and write to it. And only this tiny little green area is user state, or the safe area. This is like thinking of your house as foundation. When you put your house on a foundation in a monolithic system, it's like having a foundation that is a city-wide slab of concrete. Looks really strong and stable, doesn't it? I'd want to put a house there until I think about it. One little tremor, and what happens to that big monolithic thing? It gets a crack, and the crack expands. And then what happens? No matter how beautiful you've made your house, no matter what color you've painted it, it's going to crash, just like your computer does. Now think of a different type of house foundation, one that's made up of small squares of concrete with a tar partition in between each of those small squares. What happens when a tremor happens? It, nothing. It expands and contracts. Each, part, each section and the partitions will stop it and allow it to grow. If the worst happens and lightning strikes one of those partitions, what happens? A crack, but it stops at the partition and it does not grow and your house is safe. And that's what Synactus is. This is called a microkernel, where the majority of the code in the kernel is in user state, the safe area, and only a tiny little bit is in the privileged state. This is why your computer won't crash. What about viruses? 
I know you're thinking it. With a monolithic operating system, you are given an antivirus program, which hopefully will find a virus, but it's a band-aid. It will maybe find it after the damage has already been done. And this is where Xenaptis is really interesting. We have a patent-pending file system technology, which will make it so your computer cannot possibly get a virus. It is impossible. Here's a little bit of how it works. Say you have a file, and one program accesses it. Then it acts just like a normal file. Say two programs access it. Then it duplicates, and you now have two files. Now say an evil virus accesses it. What happens? It creates a new file just for the virus, and it keeps your version completely safe. And then the operating system gets rid of it, no problem at all. Xenactus will also protect you from yourself. And when you save your file, you get a new version. But what happens when your cat jumps on your keyboard and wipes out your presentation and manages to press the save button? This happens to me. It's okay, because your cat gets her own version. And you, you can go back to your safe version completely fine. Because Xenactus is safe. It is secure, accessible, fun, and easy for people of all ages. How would you like to know that your computer was never going to crash again, ever? How would you like to know that no matter what you do, no matter what you download, you'll never have a virus infect your files ever again? Stop blaming yourself and your computer for your issues. Blame your operating system and get a new one and put some zen back into your active life with Xenactus. Thank you.